three weeks after we broke up, I discovered that she was dating a butch. For those who don't know what butch is, butch is basically a masculine version of a lesbian. <laughs> Speaking of lesbian, do you guys know what is lesbian favorite game? It's called Rock, Pepper, Lesbian. What's up, what's up, Changu? Can you hear the guitar, guys? Hello, everybody. My name is Kauten, and I'm here just to fill the minority quota, yeah? And speaking of which, once I had a girlfriend, and she broke up with me for two particular reasons. The first reason is she said that I spent too much time playing games. Well, it's true guys, I'm a gamer. <laughs> you know, as a gamer, I think there is a one game that really stood out compared to the others. It's a, grand, a game called Grand Theft Auto. Yeah. For those who don't know what GTA is, GTA is basically a game that allows you to break any rules. Like, you can go past the red traffic light, you can ride your motorbike without any helmet, you can bribe the police, you can go to Masas Parlor and get happy ending. Wait, wait, wait a minute. That's not GTA, that's Changu! Well, anyway, the second reason that she broke up with me is simply she said that I'm not man enough for her. Yeah. Yet, three weeks after we broke up, I discovered that she was dating a butch. For those who don't know what butch is, butch is basically a masculine version of a lesbian. Yeah? And speaking of lesbian, do you guys know what is lesbian favorite game? It's called Rock, Pepper, Lesbian. Thank you. Speak. And speaking about Caesar, do you guys know what's the similarity between a Caesar and a lesbian? If Caesar is able to cut stuff, lesbian able to cut down the population growth. And speaking about the environment, do you guys know what ocean and lesbian have in common? They are both fucked by plastic. <laughs> Thank you. And speaking about fucking, do you know why lesbian often look so pale? Because they lack of vitamin D, guys. Well, anyway, given that she said I'm not man enough for her, and she was dating a bush, it's really pissed me off, especially when the butch is way more manly than I am. <laughs> and you know, then I told my friend about this and he said, Dude, you don't want to miss this opportunity. You got a chance of having a threesome. Ooh. So I did call my ex-girlfriend and we did have a threesome. No, 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 don't, yeah, yeah, don't, no, 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 no. For those who think threesome is fun, it certainly never get fucked in the ass by a butch. And thank you. And when she was about to enter my ass with a strap on, this is what she sing. I came in like a wrecking ball, and I want to break you. I will wreck you. That night, I cry myself to sleep. And to be honest, the wound is still haunt me till today. And sometimes in the middle of the night, I can't help but sing. Unbreak my ass. Say it's tightened again. Undo the hurt that you caused when you enter my shit hole and ruining my life. Uncry these tears. I cry so many nights. Unbreak my ass, my ass. And yeah, just like what Dr. Dr. Seuss say, don't cry because it's over, smile because it happened. Wait, 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 that's not the right quote. Well, anyway, I'm a married man now, guys. Yeah. And I have uh, one beautiful son. My son Jagat is one year old, and he's the best thing that ever happened to me. When he was born last year, with joyful heart, I sing this. 
isn't he lovely? Isn't he wonderful? Oh shit, that's wrong, kid. My kid is the Chinese one. <laughs> then my wife, with teary eyes, hold him tight, full of pride, and say, Now here you are, my greatest prize. To think about it, nine months ago, I almost swallow you. Thank you. Thank you. And people often ask me, Hey, Carlton, how hard it is to have a newborn? I think it's really, really hard for my wife and for my mates. And that's also why I joined the comedy, guys. Because my wife is so busy and nowhere to be pleased. So here I am, try to please you guys. Thank you. And I think judging by the reaction, you guys are more pleased with my service than my wife, yeah? <laughs> well, my son's name is Jagat. And uh, it literally means the universe in his translated in English. Because he is my universe. Yeah, although I have to be ready for the asteroid and meteor that will come along the way, yeah? I bet when he is toddler, every time I told him to go to sleep, this will be his reaction. Papa, Papa, no! I don't wanna close my eyes. I don't wanna fall asleep because I'm a spoiled brat and I don't wanna miss a thing. Thank you. Now, guys, please allow me to talk to my son. Jagat, you're just one year old now. Heck, you don't even understand a word that I'm saying. But regardless of whatever happened in the future, love you forever, I will. And even we may not always have the same understanding, please remember one thing. Even the whole world attack and you are on crack, remember one fact that I will always have your back. And now, please go to sleep because your mama ass is going to get some smack and your papa need to empty his ball sack. Thank you very much. My name is Kauten. You've been so kind. God bless you all.